I'm making the jersey or putting the numbers on the jersey for my teammate. We got a game at two, you know. Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Shirts. I'm not even making shirts. Just trying to get this jersey down for my teammate. Oh yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Oh yeah. Number 17, big deuce. Not the little one, you heard? Yeah. Alright, show me. Alright, well, put me in there. Mike, get one. So zoomed in, I gotta leave. This is the back of it. It was just a seven. Now it's 17. Now it's 17. Then on the front, it's a seven. I'm gonna have to put another one right there. So let's get to it. All right, you're getting it. Yeah, and they, they reach. Huh? Mm -hmm. Because they're short. You know, people have short attention span. They can watch them so long. Well, I mean, yeah, with them evenly, like I said, then they just they reach a lot more accounts than just the people who are following you. Yeah. Stop on focusing. That's all good. Now we got this one on here. We got the one on the side. Now we got to do the white side, even though we black today. Alright, you can end it. Y'all watch that movie on Amazon? What movie? I think it's like Married in Black. It's a Tyler Perry movie. Oh, no. This with, um, I kind of canceled Tyler Perry. The ex-husband to Tia Tamara, the one who divorced her husband. That was surprising. And somebody uh, was talking about, so there's a movie that's supposed to be coming out with a lot of known black names, and it's basically been making fun of Tyler Perry. So I'm trying to see that, because I want to know what's up with Tyler Perry. Wow. It wasn't bad. She did all, She did all right. Now we finished. Like 17 for the boy Deuce. Y'all ready? <laughs> Let's she get just inside this robot thing. And they how, how you feel after the game, man? Man, it was a good ass game, bro. I feel sick. You feel sick? <laughs> won that hoe. Oh, I thought you meant like out of nah, shape nah, sick. Nah. How you feeling after the game? Man. I feel like playoffs all over again. <laughs> uh, don't even remind me of that Not shit. Not for it. If you know what I'm talking about, go watch that shit again. Bro. How you feel after watching us lose? <laughs> they shit. They shit. I was improving, you know what I'm saying? Bro, we in the open. Get better next time. Win next game. So I just said, I'm through the whole thing. I know he gonna talk his shit. How you feeling after this upset? Double OT to lose. How you feeling? We got hugs. Should have been over after the fucking regulation, no caps. We gonna win next week. Oh yeah, yeah, we blowing everybody else out. That's our right, no caps. Yeah, 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 yeah. We played good coming off the two week. How'd you feel watching us lose? Bullshit. 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 How'd you feel watching? Man, I real spill, real shit. I'm gonna be in the defense. <laughs> defense wins games. Like, I don't care what nobody say. It comes down to defense. I don't care. I think it was the second overtime. Number 23 came down the lane. Same move. I'm talking about, uh, uh, uh. Six points. I was like, bro, someone got a. Somebody got to smack his shit, huh? smack that shit, dog. That shit can be crazy. How you feeling, Pimp? Oh, well, it's because I found out. <laughs> you and Steve did. You found out, Him and Steven hey, found out. And OT. Nah. But you showed up late, man. I was late. It's <laughs> double overtime. It's not my fault. Oh, shit, you bleeding, bro? I've been bleeding, bro. Damn. I was fucking strong.